All right, Joe, you said no more presidential campaigns are really in your future right now. What's up ahead, though, for you? Uh, well, I've been, uh, you know, I do work in campaigns. I do work for congressional candidates and gubernatorial candidates. And, uh, you know, uh, uh, and I do the Fox News uh, contributor uh, analyst kind of role, uh, mm -hmm. which I really enjoy a lot. Uh, so I think uh, those, you know, concentrate on those two things and um, mm -hmm. and uh, hopefully uh, uh, get to retire at some point <laughs> <laughs> a, few, a few years down the road. Mm -hmm. Now, do you miss all the craziness that went on, though, Joe, during all the presidential campaigns and all the other big campaigns that you've, you've really mastered? I thought I was good. I, I, I went to all, th all the debates this year mm -hmm. as an analyst for Fox, and um, it was really weird being on this side of the camera, mm -hmm. uh, you know, commenting on it instead of being in the fray. Uh, on the other hand, um, I didn't miss the pit in my stomach of, of being on the other side, you know, watching my candidate and like wishing I could dive in front of the microphone when he was saying something that was uh, wrong mm -hmm. uh, versus being on this side being able to go like mm -hmm. <laughs> being able to sort of go on the you know point out the mistakes a little bit so I it was it's taken a lot of getting used to mm -hmm. um, but I also find I got, that there's some insights that are valuable I mean that I've been being on the other side of that camera understanding what it's really like people you know to be part of that anal, you know, analytical ability to give that to people, let them know what it, what it felt like, what it's really like on the other, you know, uh, for those operatives and for the campaign candidates. I found pretty rewarding. I had a lot of fun doing it, but it was totally different feeling, <laughs> and completely different. Yeah, probably a relaxing feeling, yeah, so, like you so said. <laughs> it was a lot more relaxed. Yeah. And can you give us any insight into the 2016 election? Do you think Hillary, Hillary Clinton will be running, Joe? I hope she does. I think, I think, uh, and I think she probably will. I find it hard to believe that after all she's accomplished uh, to be literally at the point where she could be the first woman to be president of the United States. Um, I, I, you know, I think after she gets uh, takes a break from uh, all that she's done here, uh, I would be stunned to see her not 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 run. And I do think she'd be the odds-on favorite within the Democratic Party. And uh, we'll see who the Republicans would put up against her. She's going to have to fight for it. But I think I think if she runs, I think she wins the nomination. Okay. Now, when are we going to see you back in Key West, Joe? Next winter, for sure. <laughs> Next this, winter. And this, your, your, your studio, your, your station makes it so easy. I mean, I used to have to go, I'd come down here for vacation and the Fox would call me up and I'd have to go to Miami, drive up to Miami to, to do my Fox uh, uh, an analyst or commentary. Um, and, uh, you know, it wipes out a whole day of your vacation to do that, two or three hours up and back, you mm -hmm. know, six hours. So. Uh, this year, it's just been a breeze uh, mm -hmm. coming in here and uh, working with uh, wonderful people here at the at the station. And uh, and I think I've done six or seven mm -hmm. uh, Fox spots uh, mm -hmm. for the news and uh, for a special report and uh, the Megyn Kelly show. I'm uh, Megyn Kelly uh, happening now and some of the other shows. So it, it's been great, and it's only like a half hour to zip over. Right. Uh, and and uh, and I'll, uh, and then do my uh, commentary and mm -hmm. zip uh, and zip back to the to the beach so mm -hmm. uh, or the bar. <laughs> well, Which not back way? to the bar. I don't think we probably go on it. But uh, but uh, no. So it's been great. Really Good. been great. Well, we've enjoyed having you in the studio, and it's been fun watching you from the studio on then the television on Fox News. You do so good, Joe. Oh, thank so you very much. Thank you for taking the time today, talking with our viewers about what you have up ahead and gave us some predictions too for 2016 so thank thanks you. great to be with you Jenna thank you everybody for tuning in this morning I hope you can join me again tomorrow at 7 a.m. and back at 8 30 a.m. take care everybody and have a great rest of your day and now we're supposed to <laughs>